Yeah, hello everyone. Uh, welcome to Java Pro. And uh, today I have a very special guest, uh, Sang Hong Lee from Alibaba Dragonware. And hi, welcome. Uh, great to have you in this interview and uh, great uh, to have you uh, at JCon. Um, yeah, can you introduce yourself uh, briefly? Okay. Oh, okay. Uh, firstly, uh, thanks for uh, uh, JCon having me. Uh, yeah, uh, hello, uh, I'm uh, San Hong from Alibaba from China. Uh, uh, so far, I'm based in Beijing in China. And um, uh, yeah, I worked for uh, Alibaba uh, six years ago. And uh, uh, you know, in, uh, currently I'm in charge of uh, runtime and compiler team at Alibaba. Uh, I think, uh, you know, uh, in my talk, I, I mentioned uh, almost all the online applications are written in Java. Uh, we are using Java at a very massive scale. So uh, Alibaba started investment uh, on OpenJDK, mm -hmm. uh, I think uh, 10 years ago. So uh, my team is just, uh, you know, working on uh, OpenJDK development and we customized OpenJDK. Uh, actually, we have our uh, in-house implementation uh, to support our business needs. Yeah. Yeah, sounds great. <laughs> sounds great. And you uh, have uh, already worked before on uh on other JVMs, right? Yes, yes. Uh, before I'm joining Alibaba, I work for IBM mm -hmm. on J9 VM. Yeah. Yeah, interesting. And uh, yeah, you were also the the the, uh, the co-lead of the Shanghai Java User Group, Green Green Tea Java yes. User Group. Yes. 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 Yeah. Great. Yeah. Uh, yeah. 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 You know, yeah. I, I think, uh, yeah, uh, in my spare time, actually, I'm happy to co-work with uh, community leaders to, you know, move Java technology advance. Uh, as you mentioned, I co-work uh, and co-lead uh, Shanghai Jug and the Green Tea Jug. And uh, actually, um, we just uh, organize uh, activities, uh, meeting ups uh, um, uh, regularly, re regularly, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, great. Uh, yeah, your talk was about, of course, uh, the Alibaba Dragon Well, uh, and uh, it's I, I, I find this very uh, exciting. And so many people ask me, okay, uh, what's the difference between all these uh, JVMs? Are there additional functions? But what I have learned is that uh, this uh, Alibaba Dragon Well is very interesting for Java developers. Maybe you can tell uh, us a little bit about uh, the, the the cool functions uh, you have implemented. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, thank you. Uh, uh, yes, yes, actually, um, uh, Alibaba Dragonwell is based on OpenZDK. Uh, Alibaba Dragonwell is uh, downstream of OpenZDK. So uh, we uh, actually uh, will sync uh, up our code base with upstream OpenZDK regularly. Uh, based on OpenZDK, actually, we already developed a series of technology. Uh, this technology are used for Alibaba internally. Uh, just uh, in last year, we open source uh, our JDK as an Alibaba Dragon Bell. Um, uh, some feature I already talked in my session, including uh, multi tenant which allows you to run uh, multiple applications in the same JVM safely. Uh, we also our coding uh, implementation, very similar to Open JDK Loom project, mm -hmm. which yeah. is build, uh, yeah. yeah. Very similar. We just uh, uh, build a uh, user mode so that in JVM. Uh, uh, so far, our online uh, our online um, e-commerce applications uh, are, are run on top of Alibaba Dragonwell with protein enabled. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I have seen that uh, it provides lightweight threads. You mentioned that it's uh, it's similar to to Loom. Maybe yes. we can talk a little bit about uh, what is this actually? So what does Loom uh, does and, and what's the, then the difference? And uh, do I get in trouble if uh, I want to use Loom uh, then, uh, or instead of using uh, Alibaba Dragonwell? So is there the, any kind of incompat incompatible um, or is, is this compatible then to Loom? Maybe mm -hmm. you can have uh, you, you can tell okay. us something okay. about that. Yes. 
Uh, yeah, uh, I think it's a great question. And uh, I think uh, for uh, comparison between uh, Loom and uh, our our implementation, actually, uh, you know, uh, uh, firstly, from technical perspective, uh, uh, you know, for protein, uh, actually, there are two major parts. The first part is uh, uh, continuation support. Um, for our implementation, uh, as I have mentioned in our, my talk, uh, uh, our continuation implementation is based on uh, OpenGDK project that is called the Multiple Lang Language Project, MLVM uh, project. Uh, it just provides uh, room, uh, sorry, it just provides um, continuation primitive support. We just use that, uh, we just relying, we are just relying on that patch. And uh, based on that, we just, uh, you know, uh, build our own scheduler. Uh, using selector, mm -hmm. this is our whole mechanisms to run uh, user user mode threads for uh, for 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 Java application. Yes, uh, different from Loom. Actually, you know, we we just tune our application uh, for our uh, scenario. So we just uh, support synchronization. For example, if you are using a Java synchronized lock, primitive lock. Uh, we can support the routing scheduling for log for, for Java primitive log. I, I think this is something I think OpenGDK project room will consider in the future. But in our real production, we already implemented and tune it for our uh, for our uh, application. And uh, uh, we also have some limitation for current implementation. For example, we don't support I/O. We just only support the network I/O, but we don't support the disk I/O mm -hmm. of coding. Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. <laughs> and uh, it's also uh, very suited for extremely scaling, right? Yes. 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 Yeah. yeah. And then you added uh, some, uh, also some tools for developers for yes. diagnostic and so on. Maybe you can tell us something about that. Okay. Uh, yes. Uh, I, I think the first thing is uh, uh, all our internal tools are based on GFR mechanisms. Mm -hmm. uh, in, in my talk, I also mentioned that we all add, uh, also add some uh, GFR, interesting GFR events into JVM. For example, we can provide some object profiling, uh, object profiling event uh, for our application. You can use this event to tell the developers uh, where, the, where the objects get allocated, then they can use this information to optimize their application. Uh, uh, because uh, from Java mission control, you can uh, check uh, how many objects uh, um, and uh, where they, they are allocated. Let's see, uh, the, this information is uh, very useful for our developers to uh, optimize their uh, allocation. And uh, yes, uh, this is the first part that we um, did, did some extension for GFR. The, the second part is we also build some uh, uh, tools um, uh, for, you know, uh, I, I mentioned uh, we open source a GFA project, Eclipse GFA project, which is a web browser based uh, hip jump analysis. Uh, you can just use a browser to do hip analysis for your hip dump. Yeah. Uh, you know, it's. Uh, this has been open uh, sourced under uh, Eclipse Foundation. I uh, actually uh, welcome contribution. And the, yeah, so community uh, yep. co work. Yeah. yeah, great. Wow. Yeah. Uh, and uh, does uh, Alibaba also provide any uh, long term support for uh, Dragonwell? Yes, yes. yes. Uh, okay. So far, you know, we pro uh, Alibaba Gen. Alibaba Dragonwell just provide two versions. The first is Java 8, and the second is Java 11. Uh, currently, we only support uh, X64, uh, X64 platform. Uh, I think uh, in the end of this year, we will support the ARM platform. Oh. Uh, after that, yeah, after that, uh, Dragonwell 8 and 11 will cover both Intel and ARM platform. Um, for Java 8 and Java 11, we just uh, uh, provide support for our customer. Uh, for 8, we just uh, 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 provide support until to uh, 2023. 
and for 11, uh, the support has been extended to uh, 2024. Yeah, very interesting. Yeah. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. Um, I think this is very interesting for the Java community, uh, especially here in Europe and in the US, because most uh, developers they only know the the um, the, op the open JDKs from the from the vendors located here in in uh, in the US. Uh, but uh, this very uh, yeah exciting to hear what you guys have built in in china and uh yes. as i as i read it the, for the first time i thought what what uh, what the hell they are doing now uh they are developing their own jvm so there are more and more uh companies built uh their their own jvm so it's very interesting to hear what you guys have uh done and um, very interesting features and yeah thank you for your time song home and yeah. it was really great to have you in this interview and that jcon and everybody yeah. is, who is interested now in uh, uh, Dragonville should have a look on that and uh, download it, try it out. And now the video with you is, is online, the, the JCon session at jcon.1. And yeah, if you uh, guys liked our video, then subscribe to Ch Java Pro channel. Uh, thank you for your time. I uh, appreciate uh, and see you soon next year, of course, at yeah. JCon again. Thanks everyone. Yeah. Bye bye. Bye bye.